Hey guys, hello, hello, hello. Hi, I hope everybody's having a great week, weekend, holiday upcoming. Um, I'm not sure when this video will post, but um, I wanted to share with you Carla Frizzell at Carla E. Creations on Etsy. I will link all of her goodness down below. It, everybody knows who she is. Um, and on YouTube, she is Carla E. Frizzell. And I buy journals from her um, for my students. She's one of the, the um, artists that I get books from. And so this is one for one of my students for May of 2023. Yes, I've started early. <laughs> so, oh my God, I'm in trouble. Anyway, I have not opened it. It's not open. I've had this package for a while and she also sent me some happy mail that I'm gonna keep to myself. And if I use it in um, some of my tins, then I'll definitely uh, let you know that it was from her. Okay, so this came from her, and again, it is not opened. There's the other side right there. It's all taped. <laughs> so, let me just get started here. I'm going to make this a quick video because I have a ton of things going on and a ton of things to do. Oh my goodness. Ah, stress! Oh, look at the wrapping. How beautiful. Oh, Carla. Oh my gosh, guys, look at these. Oh man. And I'll never be able to get this back like this for my student wrapped as beautifully as this is oh my gosh look at these guys wait hold on hold on I gotta calm down I'm kind of yeah let me calm down and then I'll come back okay I'm back sorry about that guys um okay so hang on I got a camera tripod issue here okay so let's look at these. Look how pretty these are. I love these. <gasps> these are beautiful. Oh my God. Look how pretty. Oh, Carla, these are lovely. Girl, they are lovely. And look at the bolt pins. Oh, these are so pretty. Guys, I'm using these in my tins. Carla, thank you. These are beautiful. And I will share one with my student. I'll save one for her. I think she'll appreciate that, given she lives on 81 acres. Excuse me, 79 point something. <laughs> no, how do we put it in class? She says, oh, it's like 80 acres, but the paper says 79.3 something acres. I'm like, oh my God. Anyway, I've told you guys that story before, I think. These are gorgeous, Carla. I love them. Let me get a picture here. And so I'll save one of these for my students. Oh my goodness. And mm, I'm going to be a little stingy. <laughs> so I'm going to put some in, in my tins. I think I've got three coming up. I'll, I'll, and the other two, I'm going to one for my student and I'll save the rest. And look at the pretty eyelet on there, guys. I'm not going to undo it. Oh, I love those, Carla. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And then I'm so scared every time. Well, luckily, my students don't know how beautiful their journals are packaged. They have no clue. But when I give them, gift them to them, I do try to make it as nice as you guys do. Um, and I do pretty good, but it's never as beautiful than when I when I receive these. So this is for a student. She's Texan. She lives on 79 point blah 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 acres of land. They do a lot of farming. She has a grandfather who is um, in a memory care center because he has dementia. And but she is amazing. She's one of my students that I can share and say on here who definitely does her homework and takes her college classes extraordinarily seriously um, oh I love this <laughs> 
girl, this is not no crazy stuffing. This is perfect. I wish I could wrap it back like this when I get it back. And thank you too, Carla, for for your art and the things that you do. I appreciate you and also for just remaining to be a friend. Accept me for who I am as I do everyone. And I am so grateful and I thank you for that too. We don't have to agree on everything, right guys? But that doesn't mean we just, you know, stop loving each other. Um, so yeah, there's that. Okay, let's look. Oh, wow. <gasps> oh my goodness. And look at this pretty paper. Wait, can we just look at the paper too? Look at that paper. I don't know where she got this. In case some of you are interested, um, I will link all of her goodness down. And the reason why I do... Because Carla can do this, she can do this uh, journal on her own channel. Um, a lot of times if the artists say that they're going to show it on their channel, I just do a quick flip through, which I love because it, you know, I don't have to be here and keep you guys here all day too. Um, but I love doing it too because I don't make journals. And I'm saying all that to say if you're like me and you do not make journals, um, but you want to gift them like I do and I love gifting junk journals oh my gosh that's probably one of the most favorite things um, in being in this community is being able to gift um, the journals I, I just love it look at this I'm gonna link Carla's other a couple of other journals that she made for my students also the video it will freaking blow your mind totally blow your mind um, Oh my God, she she just she don't play. She's just not kidding. <laughs> oh, Carla, this is gorgeous. Look at this. And look at the little tags in there. Oh, I don't I don't want to move everything around. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is for my student Sarah. Oh. She's going to love this. I've been so fortunate to have. Look at that. This card may have come for me. I'm not sure. But I. it's just. Oh my God. Carla, look at this. This is all in her collection. All the goodness that she collects. This takes a lot of time. Oh, it's just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. And I am, um, a lot of the young uh, students that I give these to, i got a lot more coming up in May. Guys, believe it or not, they actually appreciate old stuff. I do have a couple of students who are moderners. They're boys. <laughs> at one of my other high schools, and they love all the modern stuff. Um, look at this. Okay, wait. See, this is why Carla should be showing this herself. Look. Look at the work that goes into this. So she's got ticking here, sewn around here, all across over to here. There's a pocket there. And look at the chicken fabric. Can we just stop and pause right there, please? Thank you. <laughs> and then this, I know is one of her signature recent signature um, elements to journals and it's just this beautiful um, collage pocket tie oh, I love this so much she's gonna love it oh man this is so pretty oh boy okay now I, I, I don't know if Carla's gonna do a flip through of this or not Maybe she will. I don't know. And maybe she has. Oh my God, I forgot to check. Dear Jesus, help me. Okay, wait, let me put these back. Because I want stuff to be like it is. You know, I like to leave things like they are. And some of you may think I'm absolutely a lunatic buying something that's not going to be gifted till May 23. But when you have as many students as I have, May 23 will be here in the blink of an eye for me it will be here really fast um and so and i'm not gonna purchase anything um not anytime soon 
um, until school starts up and I actually uh, get my employee paycheck. Although, thanks to you ladies know who you are, who have purchased things that I've shown consistently, um, I have sort of not almost replenished my junk journaling um, journals for students account but it's getting there and every single dime helps that's all I have to say about that so let's look in this yes. look at this guys look at the fabric here and the blue jean <gasps> look oh Carla girl this is killer and then she's got a little extra here. Look at that. There's some extra there. Oh, Lord have mercy. And this is handmade paper for home. I love it how junk journal makers, how you ladies, I don't know, when you fold papers in, sometimes they're just random. Like I'm working in my, I'm working in this gorgeous book here by Dolores and let me just show you guys this is what I've been working with I've been really guys I am NOT a person that stresses I, I never have been I wasn't a stressed kid or I've always been a very happy <sighs> smiley honest probably say too much because I'm honest and I want everybody to know the real feels um, I've never been like a stressed person even when my daughter passed away stress is not a word or a feeling that I would relate to that grief obviously would be um, in healing or trying to heal which is something you know I'll never heal from but I dealt with it I have never saw a psychologist or a counselor or gotten help for my daughter's loss in the 90s um, and so I just sort of nurture myself. I'm very good at that, and I trust that. If I can't fix my stuff, nobody else can. And I've said that on my videos way back when before. But lately I've been really stressed um, to the point where I'm actually working in my journals to help relieve the stress. <laughs> this is my therapy. <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure it's most of our therapy, right? But I've been working in this, and so what I mean by when journal artists have these random pages in there but like here it says for home and I'm a literary liberal arts um, professor so a lot of times things are figurative for me but I like sometimes they're literal for me this is not my journal this is for my student but what I am saying is that I love it when you open a book and sometimes I glue some things down in here just the pages are just adorable and meaningful and poignant and especially for what's going on at the time this is a page I did with Tahira we guys we barely got one page done in our books because we were talking so much but it's just fun and so when I flip through journals and I might see something um, in my journals that were made for me. This was gifted to me by Dolores at Kukui Stuff. I just think it's really, really, really interesting. I love junk journal, junk journals, journals, handmade journals, art journals, whatever we want to call them. It's all made out of repurposed and old stuff. It's, junk, it's a junk journal, right? This was gifted to me by Tahira. I love that. And that's relevant to my life right now. Oh my God. <laughs> but look at this. When I was three, I was hardly me. That would be me. I think that's still me today. I mean, I'm me, but I'm, I'm just me. And um, yeah. <laughs> Which to others may look like, what? <laughs> and I don't care. <laughs> anyway so this is a little extra here so that's what I'm working in right now is my Dolores journal continuing to glue I've got a whole pack of gluing things um, and so yeah look at this it's 
isn't it beautiful she can write in there and most of my students um, particularly at this um, school are very are come from sort of you know they're Texans and they come from religious backgrounds and things like that but the students look at that Coleridge the students um, aren't so much into that because they're young you know they're 17 18 they're babies and then look at this that she's put in there buttons little scissors a tag a little chicken <laughs> Oh my god and then in here she's got a tag look at this little pretty paper this looks like a Jessica wrap kind of paper piece I'm not sure but it looks like that look at the memoranda look at that that beautiful handwriting and I told you guys when I gifted Carla this is so beautiful it's really over the top actually just saying kind of really over the top girl <laughs> there's one of the cards oh my gosh so pretty and then let's look at a little bit more now I'm gonna flip through this just a little faster look at the um, gingham very 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 farm style some of the parents and look at the tall um, paper there you can email, you can uh, communicate with Carla. I'll put all of her information there in there if you're interested in knowing where she got this from. She may do. She'll probably do a video of this. I guess I'm not sure. I don't know. Look at this. Oh my God. Look. <laughs> oh my goodness. And the stitching. Oh, I love this. Ah, I love it. And the bingo card the chicken and roosters oh and look at that oh my goodness Carla this is beautiful 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 and there's some gardening green papers vegetable stand oh, I love this well I wait hold on have a few journals that I kept out um, because I have a lot of stuff in storage um, right now until I can organize things and um, you know till I can organize things and this is one I left out this is mine and I probably have shown you guys this before and this is made by Carla way back when junk journaling was the boom it still is the boom by the way of course but just look at the beauty of that this is this is why it's so cool to have me a collector of journals and I'm sure that you journal makers collect each other's journals and buy each other's journals I hope you do um, it's just so cool to see the evolution and style change and it's not even really a style change. It's a style that's still there, but it does evolve, right? Look at this. Just so pretty. All these tabs. I love these tabs. <sighs> I know Carla mentions Joanna um, often too and how she's inspired by her. And sometimes you can see that, but I love this book. I found when Carla gifted me, gifted me this years ago, um... 2018 can you see that <laughs> 2018 um, I was lucky enough to find another book like this and it went into a junk journaling kit I just love that cover I love it and I love the inside the yumminess of the inside I haven't started using that journal yet, but it's left out. I kept some out from storage so that I can start using them. I have a lot of journals to use, and I'm so proud. I always say that. Okay, let me keep going so I don't start chatty caffeine. Um, this is some of my coffee dyed paper she put in there. <laughs> I'll let Sarah know that, Carla. Look at these beautiful papers. 
Oh, look at my ass. <gasps> so pretty. Look at that. GC Browning General Merchandise. Oh my God. Look at this. Love this image here. My laptop is in the way, so it's kind of dark in here. Maybe if I turn it down, put it down, that might help a little bit. Oh my gosh, Carla, so pretty. And look at this. Look at that, those buttons, I love that. And she's got a rusted um, paper clip. What, what, what I was saying earlier, too, is that the parents, I noticed this past year and the year before, oh God, guys, it's been a while. Anyway, the parents are just as interested in, in this as, <laughs> as the students. Carla made one of my students um, who graduated went off to college and came back and at 19 was pregnant and had the baby um, which I am so proud of her that she did um, and that baby is spoiled oh my god he's rotten spoiled and so loved on um, she has uh, a baby journal um, that I got from Carla and she just loves it isn't this perfect guys let me go a little faster here I don't Gosh, I don't know. I hope she, maybe she might do a video. I'm not sure. She can tell you all the stuff. I'm just guessing. Look at this. Oh my God. Now, is that not cute or what? Like, who makes that kind of thing? Like, who does that? That is so cool. <laughs> that looks like that was cut out of a children's book and popped onto a library card. I don't know where she gets all this cool stuff from. She probably made it herself. Ain't, there's no telling. Ain't no telling. Look at this beautiful tab. That's what I mean by style. And she'll correct me on anything. One thing about uh, Carla and Tahira, um, if I show a journal of theirs and if I get something that's wrong or off, they'll put it in the comments and, and I appreciate that and love that. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful with those stamps? Oh my God, this this is the kind of stuff that just makes me so excited. Like when I first started curating junk journaling kits, th this is why, because this kind of thing just made me so excited. And um, it's just really cool to see how all of this comes together. And look at this tab, isn't that pretty? Mm, Carla. <sighs> <laughs> oh, this is just lovely. It's so lovely. Sarah's going to love this. She's going to love it. Look at that old handwritten um, recipe card. Just beautiful, beautiful papers. You ladies, Tahira, Jess, all of you ladies put so much love into these books, and I appreciate it. I appreciate it so much, and when I say I appreciate it, that means I see it, I feel it, it's in there. Look at that. And I just try my best to, to pass that love and appreciation for paper, for recycling, for all things um, made into art via junk. Um, via recycled materials, I try my best to pass that on to my students too. Not so much in an academic way, but in a very um, personal way. And they get it. They get it. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my gosh. I think these were some fabrics I sent her. I still have some of this fabric. Just beautiful. I sent her some of that. These were these fabrics were in some paper uh, fabric packs that I have in my Etsy store. 
and they're in a variety so there's it's like a mix of um, paper, mix of fabrics vegetable salad love this this is so pretty and I love these little images here these little tiny images here look at the baby that might be mom and grandma or grandma and great grandmother Oh, look at this pretty scene here. Carla, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at this. Look at these pieces. If you guys also have never heard of Feed the Birdies, she's on Instagram. I will link her below as well. She has some amazing, 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 amazing ephemera. Um, and that's what that reminds me of these images here I, I don't think Carla I'm not sure where Carla um, got hers from but I know that um, Feed the Birdies has a lot of different images like that so you can you can just run over and ask them the girls Carla and um, Feed the Birdies where they got where they you know how they get their stuff I don't know I don't know <laughs> I'm just the buyer. <laughs> oh my god. I love the stitching in here too, Carla. Oh, I love the stitching pages. Oh, so pretty. Look at the pretty tabs. And she's sewing those on. Oh my god. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh my gosh, look at all these beautiful fabrics. Oh, Carla, these are beautiful. They're feet sack and ticking. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh, these are so pretty. And then she's got more goodies in here. Oh, Carla, this is amazing, girl. These unfold. Look at this. Oh, oh she's going to love this so much. Oh my god, I love it so much, but I promise I will gift it. <laughs> Guys, because I'm not a farmer. I mean, back in the day, there is a picture of me feeding some chickens. <laughs> Looking like a little sunflower with, um, you know, I'll have to find that picture and see if I can post it for you guys. It's a really cute picture because I did grow up kind of a little bit farmish style. But, yeah... But, um, I don't know. I kind of, sort of, was a little farmish. Kind of, sort of. Anyway, there's pictures. There's evidence of that. But, anyway, I didn't focus on that. I went to school and hit the books. <laughs> I left the kitchen, the farm, all that. I <laughs> went straight for the books. Anyway, look at all this goodness she's put in here. Look at that. All these uh, milk caps. Look at this. Uh, this is just okay. I don't want to mess it up. Let me keep it in order. Look at that. Oh, this is just so pretty. Oh, oh. She is going to love it. Oh my god, I wish I could give it to her early, but I can't. She's got to graduate first. So I'm going to put that back in there. Oh, Lord have mercy. And then, <clears throat> oh, my God. Uh-oh, I think my video went out. <gasps> no. I think what I was saying is that um, I was showing you guys all the goodies in there. And um, I'll put it back. And, yeah. And then look at the bag this goes in. Look at that. She got, I sent her this fabric right here. <laughs> oh my God. And look at this. 
How in the world? Look at that. Oh my God. Look at this, guys. Oh my God, Carla, this is awesome. I don't know how in the world. How did you? You can put things down in there like that. Oh, and look at the flower. <gasps> look. Oh my God. Oh, Carla, this is so pretty. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Look at the back. And this fabric. Oh my God. Is all I can keep saying. And look at this as a pocket as well. She can put things in here. Oh Lord have mercy, Carla. I don't know, girl. I might have to. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, I don't know how you. I'm going to leave it alone. Fold it back up, Renee. Anyway, she got this from me. <laughs> the rest of this is like, I don't know. I don't understand. Look at. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Mm -mm. I might have to do. I don't know how, how. When you show stuff in person like that, I might have to go to some kind of crafts sh show around here one of these days and um, sort of show you guys' work off in a different setting. Not that you need that, no one needs that. But I just, I don't know, this is just really, really true textile art. All right, I'm put that together with that. And to protect it until I get ready to gift it and slip some personal things inside. She doesn't need any extra in there because look at it. And Carla has put so much in there. What, I'll, what I usually put in the books, guys, is like if a student in class says something that is personal that they like or that's a joke between the two of us and the entire class or a joke between the, the class and me just in our personal setting, um, those are the kinds of things that I will add in there um, with the theme of things that, things that they love. Um, and this... I'm not sure if I should leave this in there or keep it. I think I'm going to keep that. I think that's what I'm going to do. Look at that. <laughs> oh, boy. And I am going to gift her one of these as well. Oh, gift. I'm going to put one of them in there for her. Just one. Another one. Um... What was I going to tell you guys? Okay, I think that's it. I'm, I'm gonna, oh, I know. I'm going to put this in here. In in a bag like this for now until I get ready to fill it up. These are some bread bags when you buy bread. And, and don't worry, Carla. I will make it very nice, Mama. And I will put it back beautiful um, I always do guys I really do like I was saying that before my video went out I'm not a hundred percent recluse <laughs> not a hundred percent on how to package these nicely um, Carla thank you I'm gonna link your all your stuff here and I'll put feed the birdies in in here as well um, and um, for those of you who are interested maybe in purchasing some of these I don't know if she has any available 
but I'm going to be adding um, three of these to my uh, tins, my Flowish sewing, vintage sewing notion tins. Um, and thank you to the lady who bought um, the penultimate one in my shop currently at Etsy um, and for buying one of my stitchery uh, bundles, the stitchery bundles that I have in my Etsy shop. Thank you so much for that. I really appreciate it. Um, and I, in all honesty, guys, I, I couldn't keep surviving in my Etsy without my repeat buyers. They just keep coming back and I appreciate them and love them. And, um, and I hope I make up for it when I send off the packages. There's always, 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 like in this case, a an abundance of you know love that goes um, extra love that goes with with those um, orders and so thank you so much okay I gotta go guys um, happy end of week weekend upcoming holiday I hope you're all doing something special um, for those of you who have COVID I hope you get better soon um, I had it in January and I bounced back really quickly actually but I'm just hoping I don't get it again I am not um, being extraordinarily safe I can't lie and say that I am that would be hypocritical the only time I'm extra safe is when I'm around my mother that's it uh, I'm not wearing a mask anymore I have not been boosted don't plan to be boosted um, and yeah that's just kind of, and so far thanks to uh, Buddha and God and Jesus and Guadalupe and Allah and the cosmos and rainbows for sure um, yeah so far we're all healthy my mom is still healthy you know she's just got her general can't breathe stuff from being an ex-smoker <laughs> but she's doing pretty good um, my sister and my niece uh, they're doing better uh, my niece is doing better she's graduated and preparing for high school in September I bought her found a vintage t-shirt um, from the high school that fits her perfectly from the high school because she's a tiny little thing um, and she loved it so um, yeah but they're they're doing better they just got back from my sister's graduation trip in San Antonio um, and so yeah all is well and um, I hope you guys are doing something crafty and fun and doing well, and I will talk to you in the next video, which should be, um, I don't know what it's going to be. Um, I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. I'll just see you when I see ya. Bye.